it wasn't what we planned. We kind of had a, a, a plan to have um, a natural birth in a midwife led unit, but ultimately he needed to come out and he was sort of not the right way, so we made the choice to go with the C section, um, which in the end was what had to happen, so we were happy with that. Took some advice from Emma Jane about what kind of things you can ask for, so things like um, delayed cord clamping and skin to skin, um, just so you be as informed as you can because everything you have in your birth plan for a sort of natural birth, you sort of assume you can't have in your C section. But if you sort of go in and, and have expectations and, and are clear what you want, then you can achieve some of the things that you would want in a natural birth anyway. So it can be a good experience too. And it was a good experience when he came out healthy and happy and quickly. <laughs> so yeah, I think we sort of we talked it through with, with Emma Jane, um, did some research and just sort of made sure things we were going to have in their natural birth were sort of present in their C section as well. And during the, the day of the C section, I definitely used some of the breathing. Um, sort of leading up to the in the waiting room and in the room where you waited to go in and when I had the um, injection in the back I used the surge breathing and it was absolutely I mean I would, I would say it was pain free so I definitely use the, te the techniques just in a different way just to keep calm and, and sort of and avoid pain when it was unavoidable. He was very calm for the first probably until recently actually so I kind of put that down to me being calm and I think what it's taught me is um, just take everything in your stride stop and just and breathe if things you know if you've got a, a nappy going everywhere or you've got a crying baby or you've got a million things just just calm be, be calm and relax and things will be you know you'll get through it sort of things so I think yeah I think the calmness has continued through into motherhood I would say if I met another pregnant woman now um, I would tell her she is on a great adventure um, that she is capable of doing everything that she needs to do, whether it's during the pregnancy or during the labour, whichever way it happens, that it's a great experience, that there will be challenges but she can, she'll meet them and just to embrace it and enjoy it. And I certainly wouldn't do what some people do do, is sort of say, oh I did that and it was horrible or this happened, I would just focus on the positives because actually that's, that's the reality of it. So I would just say, enjoy it. And I think it's important to remember that it's about having the right birth for you um, on the day and you, um, and you and your baby which is what I had ultimately and I think this course helped me come to terms with that as well.